Bringing words to life. The magic of lively and animated. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel, where we make learning English fun and easy. Today, we're going to explore two vibrant phrases that often pop up in English conversations, lively and animated. Understanding these terms will not only boost your vocabulary but also help you describe people, places, and situations more vividly. So, let's dive in and bring these words to life. When we describe something as lively, we're talking about an energy that's vibrant and full of life. Imagine walking into a party where the music is upbeat, people are dancing, and the atmosphere is just buzzing with excitement. That's a lively setting. But lively isn't just for parties. It can describe anything from a person's spirited personality to a bustling city street. It's all about the vibrant energy that makes you feel alive. Moving on to animated, this term paints a picture of something dynamic and full of movement. It often goes hand in hand with lively, but with a stronger emphasis on motion and expressiveness. Think of someone telling a story with their hands waving, eyes sparkling, and facial expressions changing dramatically. They're not just lively, they're animated, showcasing their emotions and enthusiasm through their body language. While lively and animated are often used interchangeably, they do have their subtle differences. Lively focuses more on the vibrant energy and vivacity of a scene or person. In contrast, animated zeroes in on the expressive and dynamic aspects, especially in terms of movement and expressiveness. Knowing when to use each word can add precision and color to your English. Let's see both words in action with some examples. A lively discussion in a classroom shows active participation and enthusiasm among students. An animated character in a cartoon moves and expresses emotions in a way that feels lifelike and engaging. These examples highlight how lively and animated can bring descriptions to life, allowing you to paint a clearer picture with your words. And that wraps up our exploration of lively and animated. We hope this video has energized your vocabulary and given you new tools to describe the world around you more vividly. Remember, language is not just about words. It's about bringing those words to life through your conversations and stories. Thanks for watching, and we can't wait to see how you animate your English with these lively terms.